is legacy? Legacy is an attempt to transcend death. We are aware, ultimately, that eventually we're not going to be here. So legacy is, I want to extend my existence beyond my physical existence. So what I've done, what I've said, who I know, somehow that will survive me. I get to exist in other people's memory. My name is Steve Hardy. I'm an abstract watercolor artist, and I create abstract art, and I give them to people for free, and that's how I have interactions with people. So, first 15 seconds, I kind of have to establish my legitimacy as the quirky coffee house artist. A lot of times, somebody receives something and says, you're really giving this to me. Yep, have a great evening. I was really stoked about it. I left, I was like, wow, what a weird thing. But now I have this painting that I can keep in my room. I want to get my artwork out there in the world and they have kind of a pleasurable experience. Like, wow, that didn't cost anything. I wasn't expecting that. Where did that come from? So that's a big part of it. And I enjoy that. I get off on it. I like it. I've been coming here over 20 years, and as far as right now in this interview, I've given paintings to 5,237 people. That's a lot of paintings. Yeah, the fun thing with this too is when I start out, chaos usually looks a mess and then I'm imposing some kind of order on it, it seems, even though it's mostly subconscious. I make all these little small adjustments and then when I'm finished, I have something that it's almost like I didn't even create it. It appeared for me or I'm a witness to it. These littles, yeah. they have pictures within themselves here. You are correct. Yeah. It makes them intriguing. She does art. She does art too. Yeah, so I admire. She says she dabbles. She's pretty good. I reckon. I reckon. Oh, I just do a little. I do a little dabble. Next time you gotta see her work. I bet she. I bet it's amazing. Yeah, it is. I need to build on it. You're being humble. No, no. What's more important, the interaction or the art? They're inextricably linked. One without the other. It's just like, okay, I do the art personally satisfying, but if I meet somebody and it's a conversation, I enjoy it very much. I like people, I find them interesting. But then if they have my painting, I've given them a piece of me. I am giving them part of my life. Can you play a song that reminds you of Steve? So when I met Steve, I was five, about to turn six, and I would say that Steve's openness to talk to anybody probably comes from love. He has love for whoever you are. You can be the rudest person in the world and he still, he'd love to talk to you. So Steve has definitely influenced me as an artist since I've met him since I've been looking at all of his paintings. They're organic, they're not singular shapes. So when I do art, I always like to think abstract and I want to try to create shapes and they don't really conform to anything else. paintings that you've kept? Yes and no. Uh, my girlfriend, uh, several years ago, um, 
I met her here and she got art from me. She was, she was, she was suffering. She was in extreme pain a lot of the time, beautiful gal, and uh, took her own life. Before she took her life, she wanted to give him back to me. And I, and I had this kind of magical thinking, well, if I never accept him back, then she won't, she won't do anything. And it turns out um, I got the paintings back and then I can't remember her daughter or some other people, but they, they, got, they got what they liked out of there. And then I, took, I, got, I got the rest of them. I still have them. How did you move past that? I didn't. As, as far as how somebody deals with that, I don't know. It's different for everybody. But if it's somebody you care about, they kind of survive in your memory. It's a good thing. I think Steve wants to die knowing so much about so many different people and that's why he talks to everybody he can. Last time I spoke to God He laughed right in my face Once I paused you can't sit in it all We both been laughing What I usually say at the conclusion is, thank you for participating. <laughs>